Martin Creed's work number 88 is a screwed up piece of A4 paper. You can get it in a box with a letter of certification if you like. You can view images of the work in catalogues and in lofty tomes dedicated to the achievements of modern art. You can huddle with groups of perverts in profane museums to experience the work in the flesh, under glass of course. You can pore over the penetrating analysis penned by the men of letters, the unyielding pillars of contemporary culture. You can lie in a state of petrification, locked in an eternal contemplation of the mundane, losing yourself in an endless hall of mirrors. Martin Creed's work treads the well-worn boards of a long cancelled performance. This is art as a self-filating machine, a self-copulating, auto-asphyxiating beast. The Oribus has devoured itself and it has penned a love letter to its feces. Work number 88 blows through the pretentiousness of the art world like a bullet hole. It pierces the veil of the absurd and it invites a storm. Through this perforation pours the organic possibilities of the human. Conceptual art is trainable, explainable, commodifiable. Art that bleeds out of the human soul is messy, loose and subjective. Subjectivity is the killer of commerce. The art market has become the artifact market. Works of art signposts on the road of art history. The institutional opinion is the commodifiable opinion. The opinion of the masses, a chaotic cauldron which threatens the bottom line of necrotic industries. Words like love, beauty and human emotion wither on the vine of capitalism. Work number 88 is conceptual art at its zenith. Its logical conclusions played out to its predictable end. It is a detonation, a self-immolation. This is conceptual art destroying itself with the fervour of a religious fanatic. If everything is conceptual, then nothing is conceptual. If we are all verified, then no one is verified. Work number 88 is the $8 verification check peddled by an impotent billionaire. It is the handcrafted full stop at the end of conceptual art. Work number 88 demotes conceptualism to an auxiliary concern. An afterthought. The Catherine wheel of existence rides into the cerebrum like a returning monarch. The concerns of Love, the real and our squid game-like existence, are returned to their rightful throne. Martin Creed has beheaded the moribund beast of concept art. From here on in, only love and the human remains.